Hey, what's up guys? How you doing? It's me, Mr. Forecap Scaler. It's gonna be a quick video. I'm gonna show you footage of uh, Nintendo GameCube Twin Snake. Uh, but the main event here is this software. I don't want to. I don't know if I want to call it emulator. I would just call it a pretty much emulate and play everything. I would call it the true PlayStation. What this is is it's a true game console everything station this thing plays everything and it's called retro arc and it plays everything you can load any type of core core meaning uh, which system would you like to uh, load would you like to load nintendo nes uh, atari commodore i mean this thing plays everything everything that ever existed since 1970s all the way till now this thing will play it uh, and it really works well how do you download it well you just go to uh, retro arc type in uh, search Google retro arc and you go to their website and download it now there's a variety of different uh, emulators out there you know you got dolphin which is the one that I like you got the MU which is for Nintendo VU uh, but this one here it's definitely the best I would say retro arc and hey, let me just show you uh, just how good it is it really is like a it has that little PlayStation like uh, user interface and it works excellent with the uh, Xbox one controller here let me show you really quick here you go it is like a PlayStation 3 user interface you know for those of you who had playstation 3 you will definitely recognize it as a playstation 3 or playstation uh vita it has the same interface uh purposely probably was made like that but anyway let me just uh show you one quick example so just how basically it works you have different types of cores okay i'm going to load a core and it's going to ask me what type of core would i like to load I only put few here there's some more you can download more cores okay uh, and you can download any system out there that ever existed since 1979 till now I mean I'm not kidding I'm serious guys uh, so yeah pretty much everything and uh, the one I have it's GameCube and V uh, by Dolphin so I'm gonna go ahead click on it and then I'm gonna come down here and load the content and I'm gonna go to my directory on a D and uh, I'm gonna go up here and check my emulator uh, games they should be right over here there they are and I'm gonna see a bunch of games here I don't know if you guys can see it uh, so I'm going to go down here and click on Metal Gear Solid, uh, Twin Snakes, uh, Disc 1, and you will see it is going to boot up, it's going to start, no issues. So I'm going to go to the directory, I'm going to click on it, the ISO, and uh, I'm going to select the, uh, the GameCube with Dolphin. This also supports Wii. Uh, MU is the one that supports the... Uh, uh, Nintendo VU but anyway here we go and you will see it is gonna start right away we're gonna put it on the full screen there it is I'm gonna adjust my uh, picture here this is something that happens uh, in the beginning this sound but and then it starts becoming normal by the way, there is a way for me to uh, upscale this to 4K, and with the uh, this software, you have the ability to actually render this in 4K, as a matter of fact. And with the MU and Dolphin, you have the ability to run some of these games in 4K, but your PC is going to need a lot of power, okay? This was on GameCube, 
don't know if some of you remember this game. 20 Snake was the uh, remake of the original Metal Gear Solid. It was called uh, Twin Snake, but it's really about the same, pretty much remake of the original, which was the Metal Gear Solid. Wait till I start rolling some of these games on my television. And you will see just how beautiful these games look. Uh, what I'm doing basically here, I'm just showing you a demo, okay? Uh, this will, this looks much better on a 4K TV with the HDR compression, okay? As you see, there's no hiccups. This uh, retro arc runs everything smoothly. After the SDV gets as close as it can, dispose of it. From there on, you'll have to swim. High Tech Special Forces Unit Foxhound, your former unit, and one that I was the commander of. So they're still around. There are six members of Foxhound involved in this terrorist activity. Psycho Mantis with his powerful psychic abilities. Sniper Wolf, the beautiful and deadly sharpshooter. Decoy Octopus, master of disguise. Falcon Raven, giant and shaman. And Revolver Ocelot, specialist in interrogation and a formidable gunfighter. So there you go, uh, I'm not going to play this entire sequence, I'm just doing this just to show you how wonderful this uh, software is, man. So yeah, you guys should definitely uh, go check this software out. Uh, you can download different cores, you can come here and uh, you can hit the load core or you can download some more cores. I mean they got a bunch of cores that you can download. Uh, look, Just look, let me just show you how many uh, cores they have. This is what they support. They support 3DO, uh, 3D Engine, Amiga, uh, arcades, you know this is like uh, emulators for the arcades. They support everything. Colonel, I didn't know they support everything here. This is quite something here. Anyway, so uh, Atari Jaguar. I mean, man, you name it. Uh, Commodore 128-bit, Commodore 64. Uh, unbelievable. They got everything. Game Boy Advance, Game Boy Color, uh, Jesus, man, the list goes on and on and on. Uh, handle held electronics. So whatever you want, it's here. I mean, even PlayStation 3 is here. Uh, they got everything. Uh, PSP, they got the PSP. Uh, they got Sega Dreamcast. Uh, I mean, like, guys, I could go on forever. They support everything. Even the Xbox One, the Xbox 360. So, you got everything here. Okay. So, anyway, just a quick video. I wanted to do this just to show you uh, what this thing supports. It supports everything. Uh, so, definitely go ahead. Give it a try. It's called uh, Retro Arc. And... Uh, I think this is very unique because you don't have to go ahead and download all these separate emulators. Uh, this one software puts all of your emulators in one place and you can just have a feast and enjoy it. Enjoy all these games, you know. I mean, technically with this uh, uh, RetroArch, 
you can have the entire game console, everything that ever existed, uh, you can emulate here. And on this PC, you, you can play forever the entire library of the games that existed. So there you go. There you have it. Uh, I'm trying to give you guys a little tips here for those of you who are into emulators and gaming. Look, uh, I'm mainly focused on 4K and television, and that's what I'm doing uh, in the video showdown between TCL and Sony X900E will be done it will be done really nicely I'm gonna do that video uh, and I'm also gonna go ahead and uh, test uh, some of these games being upscaled to 4k and also I'm gonna test some of the VU games running in 4k through this emulator Dolphin uh, there's another emulator called the M MU and then Dolphin I'm going to try to upscale some of these games and run some of these games in a, in a native 4K resolution through the PC via my television uh, X900E. So there's going to be a lot of interesting stuff going on that I'm going to show you some tips, some uh, some cool hints on how to do this. Uh, I, believe me, guys, I spend a lot of time researching all of this, you know. But don't worry, that video that I know everybody's waiting for that video, it will be done on Friday. Okay, you will see that video, uh, TCL versus uh, Sony X900E. And we're going to check only full array of local dimmings and deep dark levels to see how well they are. Okay, and uh, it's going to be a pretty long video, it's gonna be about 20 minutes, 25 minutes. Uh, we're going to check it properly from each angle, uh, top to bottom, in different conditions, lightings, all of that will be done. But that's going to be on Friday evening, okay? In terms of live stream, there will be a live stream. You might see me do a live stream of uh, Metal Gear Solid Twin Snake on uh, late Friday night or Saturday. I might either do a Friday night or Saturday. Most likely Saturday you will see it, okay? So that's the plan. All right, guys, thank you for watching, and I'll see you on the next video.